Hey, Austin Davis here with FinalDriveParts.com. Came into the shop, seen a bunch of new stuff going on this week. Got with Travis, he's the chief rebuilder and head shipping technician here. So I asked him, we got some questions on the internet lately. What are the most common failure items of a final drive motor? And we just happen to have a whole slew of parts laying out here on the bench. So Travis, yes, tell me, what, what do you see the most? Mostly we see bearing failure. It's gonna be your main bearings, which we previously have done videos on. You scroll down and you might find one main bearing failure. Uh, your gear bearings. I mean, this is a Kyaba drive, KY, other known as a KYB. So this is just uh, reference, which is most likely set up the same. The lower gear bearings with this particular drive, you will notice the play in them. Now, is that too much play? Well, right here, we actually sit inside here. So what you would do now is move it back and forth, which this is actually a good bearing. But if you have too much play, or junk. Another thing would be is the, the gear teeth. These are actually have a flat tip on them. They're roughly still in pretty good condition. If they're at a point, they're worn out, there's going to be too much slop in the, the gear hub. So, okay, so that. you ought to inspect the gear. So if it's, it's got a sharp point on it, then they're worn. you're, you're worn out. But if it's still yes, got sir. a flat edge on the top, then, then that's still okay. Yes, sir. Other thing you want to check, well, I do not have a lower shaft out right now, but all you have to do is check the spawns on the upper and lower shaft, wiggle it back and forth in the shaft, see how much play is in there. If there's too much play, then it's, it's worn out. Uh, this little plate right here actually holds down the three or four lower gears. Right here you want to see, because it sits right on top of the bearings, and from the bearing going up and down, it'll actually groove this too much. Yeah, actually I see you it. Can there's see one it, there and there. But it's not actually grooved if you feel. Right, yeah. It's kind it's of scuffed a little bit, yes, right? Yeah. So it's actually might be reusable. Needs a little bit further inspection, but that's for what. What I about have some here. of these seals and O-rings and seals? Every every drive we rebuild, we rec we replace this every seal. Yeah, every yeah. seal. I mean every seal. It's very important. Well, that's cool. And anything with any of these smaller parts, do you ever see one where just a, a bolt comes loose? Is that does that ever happen or it's screw? I'm not going to say yeah. it doesn't happen, sir, but it's not likely because every bolt on the drives are actually supposed to be torqued down to a certain spec. Right. And that's never hardly the issue. It's usually the bearing failure, to be honest with you. Okay, and we talked about rebuilding before. You guys sell new final drives, uh, rebuilt. Rebuild uh, replacement yes, drives that are already on the shelf ready to go, but you can also ship your drive here and free you'll tear it down. Free estimate. You'll, you're tearing, this is what you're doing for a customer. So you're going to tear it down, go through each individual part, go through all the, the hubs, and uh, come up with an estimate and send it to the customer. And then the, the warranty. What's the warranty on a rebuild? One year parts and labor warranty. One year. One year, One year warranty on the, on the rebuild. Now you can go ahead and call the, uh, any of our competition. There's nobody out there. There's no way out there has a one-year parts and labor warranty. And a two-year warranty on a new drive, which is an industry first. And these guys are setting the standard there, too. Yes, sir. Man, good job. These guys do great work. If you got a final drive motor that has a problem, send it here. Let Travis and the rest of the gang do it. The phone number? 1-888-9-FINALS. You can also reach the website. There's a link on the video, and there's a link down in the description. Come over, give them a call. They want to help. See ya.